Welcome to the Currys and PC World Belkin Networking Train. When you walk into the networking aisle, what's the first thing that you see? Take a look, as a customer would, at the aisle behind me. As you can see, it's 57 black boxes. Customers really don't have a clue when they look at that selection to which product to choose. What we're going to do in the next few moments is guide you through exactly how to choose the right product for the customer with them. So what's the first question we ask customers when they come into the networking aisle? It's, who is your internet provider? The question is simply, BT or cable? When the customer tells you who their provider is, it's either BT or cable. If it's cable, this is the selection. And if it's BT, this is the selection. So now we know the first question is BT or cable. The second question, what could it be? Number one, it could be how many devices are you connecting to the internet? Number two could be how large is your house? And there are lots of other questions that you may have that you may not want to ask the customer. But if I could give you a second question where 84% of customers would answer yes, and you could find the right product for them, the best product for them, and how they use the internet, would you be able to remember it? Do you download, play games, or stream online? To many customers, stream means simply a river. If you ask the customer, do you download, play games, or stream online, like BBC iPlayer or YouTube, then they get to understand the question and how they use the internet. When we ask the question, do you download, play games, or stream online, like BBC iPlayer or YouTube, we know that 84% of customers answer yes to that question. That means that we can go to the best product for them with the fastest speed. This is the Playmax N600 router, modem router for BT. We've selected this product because it's dual band. That means that there are two channels of N300 speed. If a customer is watching BBC iPlayer or YouTube, then they're watching on one channel. When somebody else comes online in their house, that's given another channel, meaning that you don't get buffering or a delay in signal when the signal is coming through from the supply. To explain that in a way a customer would understand, is simply imagine your internet signal supply is coming in like this through the center. Dual band opens up the top of the signal or the supply so more than one person can come in to that stream. What are the additional benefits of the Playmax modem router from Belkin? On the side of the box you'll see here that you have two USB sockets showing one connected to any USB printer, meaning you can make it a wireless network printer, and then also any USB hard drive that means that you can connect any hard drive into the system. What you can then do is use that hard drive to back up your machine. Anyone else on your network that you want to back up the machine, they can also back up to that external hard drive. But here's the cute thing. Every hour that you're on the network, the external hard drive will reach back through the router, check for files that you've saved in the last hour, and then save them back onto that hard drive, meaning that you have continuous hourly backup. The next major feature with the Playmax modem router is that if you're connected to the external hard drive that's plugged into the USB socket and you download torrent files, hands up if you download torrent files, then you can start your torrent download coming in here from the internet supply and then say save to the backup drive. As soon as you press go on your laptop, you can close your lid. No more overnight downloads because the signal will be coming in through the router straight into the backup drive, saving both energy 
of time and fail down. So let's take a look at the range and see how we come down from presenting the best product first. Here we have Playmax, it's dual band with two USBs. That means you can connect any USB printer and any external hard drive for wireless printing and file saving and, and backup. Next down the range we have the Play. It's again dual band, but this time it only has one USB. That means you can connect it to either wire, uh, any USB printer or any external hard drive. As you come down again to the share, this is N300 speed, but not dual band, but it does have one USB. That means again you can connect it to either a USB printer or an external hard drive. As you come down the range to Surf Plus, the Surf Plus has no USBs and is at N300 speed. Finally, you get to the Surf, which is M150, for the customer that really just wants a basic printer. So now you've seen the whole demonstration of how to ask the customer the first question and the second question and go to the right product. You're in the same place that they were when they started this journey. All you have to do is ask, do you download, play games or stream online like BBC iPlayer or YouTube and you can present the best product for the customer. Congratulations, you've now completed your first Belkin online training.